Hi guys, this is Kimmy Angs and welcome to my YouTube channel. Well, today I have got another unboxing video for you guys and this is part 2 of the unboxing day series. And today I will be unboxing the Gran Turismo 7 anniversary edition for the PlayStation 5. Um, purchased as you guys can see through Games Shop. And this is day 1 delivery, March 4th and uh, as always games the shop has been punctual with their delivery timelines and uh, there is a lot of bonus content that comes with the anniversary edition hopefully i'll also fire this up and give you guys a quick tour of how the ui uh, looks on the game itself right uh, going straight into the unboxing now and um, incidentally this is actually going to be the last video that I upload using my Samsung Galaxy Note 20 Ultra because tomorrow on the 5th I am actually getting my hands on the Samsung Galaxy S22 Ultra as many of you guys are aware that um, Sony has uh, sorry <laughs> Samsung has discontinued the Note series and the S22 Ultra is the the new Note and S series combination, if if I can put it that way. So, whatever content you will be seeing after this video will be shot with the Galaxy S22 Ultra. Okay, so you've got these two boxes. Uh, you've got one box, and you've got what I'm con what I think of is a poster. Yes, there you have it. So you have Gran Turismo 7, the real driving simulator, pre-order now. Okay, just a a pre-order <laughs> print that they've given ex PlayStation 5 exclusive also available on the PlayStation 4 right so this is the poster that they've given off and uh, here we've got thankfully it's not as taped up as the <laughs> charging station box was because it was quite a pain you know to pull out all that tape and go about unboxing oh this is going to be pretty quick yes there we go and we've got some more things that are just okay whatever else is there well i think it's all in the game itself so this is how the 25th anniversary edition of gran turismo 7 looks like and uh, if I were to show you guys what all is there, you've obviously you've got the PlayStation 5 game disc, you've got a steelbook case, you've got a full game download voucher for the PlayStation 4, so you have the PS4 version of the game itself as well. You get, wow, that's a million credits, yeah, or one lakh credits as we, oh sorry, 10 lakh credits as we like to call it in India. So you get a million in-game credits, you get the Toyota GR Yaris. You have 30 partner PSN avatars, and you get the official digital soundtrack. Um, on the on my mail, in fact, uh, Games Shop has sent me the voucher redemption code um, for the pre-order bonus. So I will have a look at that. But yes, this is what the anniversary edition has. Anything else that I've missed in the box? It doesn't look like. Uh, yep looks just about okay i'm guessing the steel bookcase might be in the in this itself anyways uh, let's go about unboxing this right so if you guys um, are on discord you can join in the playstation india uh, server the link for which I will be leaving in the video description and uh, you guys can actually be a part of a big gaming community out there not just limited to PlayStation gamers but also to Xbox and PC as well as mobile gamers there's a joke that goes on <laughs> around on the server about mobile gaming in fact if the mod is watching this <laughs> he's gonna have a good laugh about it so so yeah okay I think my steelbook case has not come. <laughs> Anyways, I will, I will talk to Game the Shop about it. And uh, and yeah. Anyway, so this is how 
or probably this is the steel book case i don't know i'll have to check with them <laughs> anyway so this is a very elegant looking case for the playstation 5 anniversary edition disc and here you've got some more uh and that's just a eu declaration and you've got the oh i can't actually reveal to you the code for the full game content <laughs> and then of course you've got my disc right there right so this has been unboxed now time to fire up the console and show you guys how it looks on the game itself i'm actually not going to be using my steering wheel i'll be using my controller because it's easier to navigate rather than you know fetch for the right buttons on <laughs> the thrustmaster sf1000 wheel itself so i'll see you guys there right so this is firing up the grand turismo 7 game and let's see what kind of graphics we get to behold 25th anniversary for grand turismo and i'm actually going to stay silent now and let you guys enjoy this video
so here we have the menu for the Gran Turismo 7 this is the main menu and then you've got a sub menu so here you've got two options one is the music rally and the other is a world map I've actually already played the first mission of the music rally which I definitely need to better because I'm not happy with what I've accomplished but uh, it's quite simple uh, you complete one mission and then the next music rally unlocks wherein they play the entire music and uh, you have to pass checkpoints through which more time gets added and the number of miles that you complete for the length of that song gives you the trophy that you're looking at whether it's a bronze silver or uh, a gold so so yeah that is good gameplay content to upload for my youtube later in the coming weeks and then of course the second thing is you got the world map that's your main menu very much uh, like how you would have on the Gran Turismo Sport but it's very different too at the same time this has more of you know the need for speed kind of layout and user interface wherein you have a map and uh, you can actually go around to different subsections like the garage wherein you know it has it houses the cards that you own currently along with you know settings that you can make to your car uh, tuning parts and then of course this shows the car collection that you currently own well since i have the uh, anniversary edition i've also gotten special cards unlocked as a pre-order bonus the supra the 919 the rs and the rx vision concept so so on one side you've got the garage on the other side you've got the cafe which basically shows you different options of racing that are there and uh, and then you've got a used car dealership wherein you can walk in and with your credits buy another car that can get added to your collection so oh, they got an SLS AMG too I'm <laughs> drooling there already anyways I've got the 911 which I'm quite happy with for now <laughs> Uh, and uh, and then finally when you actually need to do your racing uh, world circuits is where you go to and uh, it will actually show you the available options so you complete one race then the next location gets unlocked in that region so the Americas, the Europe, the European subcontinent and then you got the Asia, Oceania and then like you always have with uh, like we had with GT as well you have a daily workout in the top right hand side corner which shows how many miles you've completed and it also gives you a collector level basically when you buy a car the the performance level of that car determines the collector level that you are on it is quite different from Gran Turismo Sport let me assure you because um, if you remember there were mission challenges there were circuit experiences there were training videos in GT Sport which I don't see on the GT7 now so I guess if you want to do those kind of um, if you want to do the, that kind of racing and if you want to be more versed with how Gran Turismo works then I think GT Sport is what you need to complete first and then make your way down to Gran Turismo 7 but of course in terms of graphics in terms of fluidity of the frames and the and just the visual uh, experience that this game offers GT7 is a huge step up from what GT Sport used to be so I highly recommend you know getting this into your gaming collection so this this was the this was the home screen and the UI of Gran Turismo 7 right so this brings me to the end of the unboxing of the Gran Turismo 7 anniversary edition for the PlayStation 5 guys please 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 get yourself a copy of Gran Turismo whether you love racing or not this game is a must have in your gaming library if you are on the PlayStation ecosystem it is such an amazing game to have and I'm sure even if you're not too big a racing fan you will enjoy what this game has to offer it has something to offer for every person.
not just for you know the hardcore racers out there <laughs> anyways as always i will be leaving a link in the description below for the playstation india discord server do join in if you're on discord uh, i will also be leaving my social media links or my social media handles so if you guys want to connect with me on facebook or on twitter or on instagram then you know where to find me also before i sign off i do require help from you all i am actually looking for a good quality horizontal dust proof cover for my playstation 5 so if you guys have any recommendations please do leave them in the comment section so i can look it up and order one for myself as well anyways guys i hope you guys have enjoyed this video apologies for the length of the video because uh, but yeah i wanted to cover as many bases as i could before i sign off and uh, please like share comment subscribe this is kimmy angs taking your leave take care guys stay safe enjoy your gaming ciao